Hello everybody, what's up, what's up? This is Andre Farnell, you're on Built to Thrive TV. And today I'm talking to you from New Jersey. I am in the storage facility where the first, I would say, half of my life as an adult man, where all of my things were. Also where my now wife, Nicole Lundy, where all her stuff was stored. So we were stored in this unit here, which I'm gonna give you a view of. And it's empty now, but when we came, it was full, right? Full with furniture, full with all the trappings of success, or what I believed was success at the time, and full of the things, you know, all of the things like, uh, you know, photos, memories, um, things that I held dear, things that were important to me. And what Nicole and I did was we went through everything with a fine tooth comb to determine what would make it into our new life. And there was a state of purge that happened. Like uh, there were tons of things that we threw out, old clothes, you know, we had a lot of memories and attached to those things were energy you know sometimes you got to get rid of old energy to make space and room for new energy and we're a newly married couple we've been married for a year and you know always in the back of my mind there was an an energy of you know our stuff being here we actually paid for this stuff to be here on a monthly basis for almost three years and you know always thinking back to how is our stuff doing in new jersey and I uh, wish I had this and, you know, just things that you held dear, like the important things. And then all of that energy sort of, you dragged it everywhere you went, um, subconsciously, of course, you know. And now all of that is gone. It's different. Um, we just packed it, all of the things onto the to the trailer that's going to be taking it over to California and now we you know we have the things that we held dear as well as we got rid of a lot of things and one of the things I want to share with you that was most gratifying or the most uplifting about this whole process is that we were able to give away things that we were not using you know we made it three years without living with any of this stuff and you know, you realize that when you acquire or when you start to get a ton of things, like things, you buy the things, but then at some point the things run you. Like they have maintenance, they have energy, you have to upkeep them, you have to think about them, you have to invest energy into them. So it's important, you know, to really not put so much stock in things um, that's one of my biggest takeaways and one of my biggest takeaways is that since we weren't using the stuff we could give those things to other people and be have them be blessings to other people they served their time with us and now you know it's time for those things to bless other people and we you know i'm able to feel that like that's a blessing and that's a, a takeaway from doing this this process um, it's actually the first time I've ever looked through all of my stuff and the, you know look through them with the perspective of being a, a husband and look at them as a, a new beginning and this is a, a lot different than anything I've ever done I've never been the man that I am now so looking at things and acquiring things like it's changed my entire perspective on it um, the importance I once gave to things like some of those feelings came up for me too like how important it was um, some of the like watches and jewelry and stuff it actually got misplaced and you know it it, it was it felt like it would be like a, such a devastating thing to me but it's really it's really not like um, I've matured and I've grown since even putting things in the storage three years ago, I'm a whole different human. Uh, that's another thing to take into account too. A lot of times we get caught up in a, assigning 
a certain value or even like having our self-value, our self-worth tied up into things. And you don't, that's not a healthy way to deal with things. And so, you know, I was able to detach myself in, in recent times from having myself, my self-worth attached to, you know, things that, you know, just things in general. I'm looking forward to this new chapter of life. Uh, we all change, we all grow. And to purge every once in a while is awesome. I feel freer, I feel lighter, I feel clearer. Um, I'm just very optimistic and very hopeful and very feeling very awesome. So I just wanted to make a post to give you guys an idea of um, what a good clean purge can do. Um, in the comments or below this video, write out some things that you've given away and made room for in your life. Like things that were once important like have, if you cleaned out a closet or if you cleaned out a room or decluttered your house, like what effect that has had on you? This is ha this is going to have a huge effect on my life going forward. And uh, share some of your instances below in the comments. As always, you're greater than any past programming. You're greater than any current circumstance. And ultimately, you're responsible for sharing the greatest version of yourself with the world. Peace. You're built to thrive. New Jersey, goodbye.